With so many stock market brokerage account options out there, it can be super overwhelming to find the one that best aligns with your goals. But that's why in this video, I'm going to explain exactly what to look for so you can confidently choose the best option for you. Whether you plan on day trading, swing trading, or investing for the long term, we're going to cover five important characteristics that you really should be paying attention to when looking for an excellent brokerage account option. Okay, so by far the most important thing that you need to do first is determine your investing or trading goals. And this is really important because it'll clarify what you should be looking for in an account. So if you plan to day trade, you'll wanna look for an account that offers advanced charting and trading tools. If you plan to invest for the long term, you'll wanna look for an account that maybe offers fractional share trading so you can dollar cost average into the market. Or maybe you're a really conservative investor looking to invest in fixed income securities like bonds. In that case, you want a platform that supports trading those securities. Whatever you plan to do though, clarifying your goals is the best first step you can take. So if you haven't done so already, I highly recommend pausing this video, writing down your goals, and then returning to the video when you know exactly what you're looking to do. Now that your goals are clear, the first characteristic that you wanna pay attention to is the fee structure. Are there commission fees for trading the assets that you want to trade? Are there account minimums? And are there account fees? Many legacy brokers like Charles Schwab have slashed their commission fees in recent years because of the newer kids on the block like Robinhood and Webull. So to find a brokerage that doesn't charge trading fees for stocks and ETFs is, to put it in an elegant way, pretty damn easy. But the story is a little bit different for those looking to trade more advanced securities like options as the number of commission-free brokers drop. Swinging back to Charles, Schwab, while they do offer commission-free investing for stocks and ETFs, they still do charge a fee for trading options. But either way, whichever platform you're looking at, make sure that you understand the fee structure for the types of assets you plan to trade. Number two is especially important for beginners and that is access to a paper trade portfolio. When a broker offers this, you get to practice trading the live market with fake money, so there's zero risk on the line. This is a great way to get comfortable buying and selling, getting comfortable with the platform, and just the trade process in general. Now, not every broker offers paper trading, but platforms like Webull, TD Ameritrade, and Inter interactive brokers do. So if this is an important feature for you, make sure that the platform you want to go with offers it before signing up. Number three, you wanna make sure that you go with a broker that offers trading and research tools that align with your goals. If you're a day or swing trader, performing technical analysis is going to be a lot more important for you compared to someone that's looking for a simple platform that they can buy stocks on and hold for the long term. Even as a long term investor, the research tools are still gonna be important for you. They're just gonna be different than what's important to an active trader. And this is exactly why the first step you should take is clarifying your goals. That way you know what to look for in a platform that best caters to what you want to do. And number four is customer service. Having easy access to knowledgeable people ready to answer your questions or walk you through an issue is super important. If you ever have a question about a certain feature, about your account, or you just need help understanding something, you should easily be able to pick up the phone or live chat with someone who can walk you through it. Charles Schwab is a prime example of this as they offer a live chat feature plus the option to pick up the phone and talk to someone almost instantly. They're always super friendly and professional, which is a characteristic you wanna look for in a good brokerage platform. And at number five is education. Finding a platform that offers a gold mine of educational content can mean the difference between a bad investing experience and a really great one. Some of these resources include videos, guides, tutorials, tips, and more, which can all come together to help you become a super knowledgeable and skilled investor. Even just spending 30 minutes per day learning something new through your brokerage account can put you so far ahead on your trading or investing journey. This is something that I tried to do as best as I could when I first started learning about the stock market. A huge library of high quality content also tells me something else about the broker. That is that they care about the success of the trader or investor and that level of quality and care carries over into other areas of the trading and investing experience. Now that you know what to look for in a high quality stock market brokerage account, you'll wanna click on this video here when it's released for my picks for the best brokerage accounts for 2023 and beyond.